CCC Interim Secretary General suspended pending disciplinary hearing. The Citizens Coalition for Change CCC Standing Committee has taken the decision to suspend Interim Secretary General Senjizo Chibangu with immediate effect. Pending a disciplinary hearing, the suspension comes after Chibangu failed to attend crucial meetings. According to a statement released by CCC Interim Committee Deputy Chairperson Albert Mlanga, Mlanga expressed the committee's concern over Chibangu's repeated absence from meetings despite receiving invitations. Additionally, Chibangu submitted a replacement list for the Bulawayo Senate and proportional representation to the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission ZEC without the approval of the Interim Standing Committee. These actions led to the decision to suspend Chibangu. The CCC Interim Standing Committee sat on February 21st amid a great concern about the appointed CCC Interim Secretary General Chibangu for not attending our meetings on several occasions despite invitations being sent to him and further went on to submit a Bulawayo Senate and proportional representation replacement list to Zimbabwe Electoral Commissions Act that was not agreed upon by the Interim Standing Committee in our last meeting. Stated Mlanga, the CCC Interim Committee also declared null and void the announcement made by Harare Mayor Jacob Mafium, who appointed Welshman Kyub as the Interim President based on the 2019 Guerra Congress. According to Mlanga, this move established a separate party known as CCC Welshman, while the CCC party that recalled members, appointed Shibangu, and was led by former President Nelson Chamisa remains the formalized CCC. Mlanga clarified that the interim chairman Dingalizwich Shuma would lead the party for the next 90 days until a Congress date is set. He further criticized Shibangu for engaging with Mafium, Mkub, and Ten Naibidi, who were not part of the interim standing committee that appointed him as the CCC interim secretary general. Moreover, the CCC camp denounced the Bulawayo Senate and proportional representation replacement list submitted by Chibangu to Zek. Mlanga emphasized that all elected members of parliament, council, and senate should continue their duties until the end of their term and consult with stakeholders and citizens for the way forward. With immediate effect, the CCC party has suspended the CCC Interim Secretary General Shibanga pending a disciplinary hearing. We have realized that Shibanga was only looking for positions through securing our signature to endorse him as the secretary. We had agreed that the recalls would only be affected in Bulawayo to deal with those elected but coming from outside Bulawayo, but to our surprise Shibangu decided on his own to go beyond Bulawayo. Mlanga stated, Mlanga accused Shibangu of overstepping his authority by recalling individuals in Mashinalan provinces without proper consultation. He criticized Shibangu for surpassing the initial agreement and imposing his own choices highlighting that parties formed outside Bulawayo tend to fail. Mlanga reiterated that the CCC leadership is an interim national structure awaiting a Congress. The disciplinary hearing will determine the outcome of Chibanga's suspension and shed further light on the internal dynamics and power struggles within the CCC. As the party prepares for its Congress, the decisions made in the coming months will shape the future direction of the CCC and its role in Zimbabwean politics.